how to find equivalent fractions using a number line. Equivalent fractions are fractions that have equal value even though they're divided into a different number of parts. Normally when we use a number line, we're looking at increments that go up by one whole at a time. However, when we're looking at fractions, we want to look at the spaces between those increments. So the number line we're using today goes from zero to one whole. First, we're going to place one half on our number line. Our denominator is two, which means we're going to divide our number line into two equal parts. Our numerator is one, which means that's the very first increment on our number line, which gives us one half. We're then going to draw another number line above our number line. This number line we're going to divide into four equal parts. This means we're dealing with quarters. Our denominator is four, so we're dividing our number line into the four equal parts. We're then going to draw a third number line. This time we're going to divide it into eight equal parts. We're dealing now with eighths. Our denominator is eight, and so therefore our number line must be divided into eight parts. Now we can find equivalent fractions. We're finding fractions that line up perfectly on those three number lines. Two eighths and one quarter line up perfectly on the number line and are equivalent fractions. Four eighths, two quarters and one half also line up perfectly and are equivalent of each other, which means they have the same value. Six eighths and three quarters also line up and are equivalent fractions. We can also say that 8 over 8 and 4 over 4 are a value the same as 1 and are equivalent to each other. The next step is to combine all three number lines into one number line. To do this, start with the biggest intervals. Add on your quarters and then add on your eighths. You can then clearly see our equivalent fractions line up on our one number line. And that's how to identify equivalent fractions on a number line.